hand signals in officiating badminton. Hand signal on shuttle falls inside the court. If the shuttle cock lands inside the line, no announcement is needed. The judge will point the right hand at the line. Hand signal on service fault. If a player fails to hit the bottom of the shuttlecock when serving, the line judge will open the right hand and lightly touch the palm with their left hand to indicate service fault. Hand signal on delay of service. When the server takes too much time to serve, or delays service for undue reasons, then it is called a fault. When undue delays occur, the service judge will swing the right arm to the left to indicate that a player has been penalized for undue delay. Hand signal on feet on the service line. According to Rule 9.1.2, the server and the player receiving the serve should stand in the diagonally opposite service courts and must not tread on the service court boundary line. Judge will stretch out the right leg and signal a fault with the right hand because a player's feet were off the ground or they were on the boundary line. Hand signal on shuttle falls outside the court. If the shuttle cap lands out of bounds, the line judge must loudly and quickly shout out so that both players and spectators hear and will stretch their arms out to the side level with each other while looking at the umpire with a fixed stare to ensure the umpire is clear about the decision. Hand signal on double hit. When the shuttle comes to your side, you have only one attempt to hit the shuttle. When your rocket makes contact with the shuttle, you cannot hit it again until your opponent returns the shot. In doubles, only one player in a partnership is allowed to hit the shuttle. If both players touch the shuttle with their rocket, it's a double hit. Thank you for watching!